Hey guys, my name is Randy, aka Guy Loves Fashion, and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my first sneaker review. And what better way to do your first sneaker review than with an unreleased pair of shoes? I'm going to be reviewing the Yeezy Boost 700 and the Analog colorway. Big shout out to Soul by JC on Instagram. He's the one that actually got me these shoes. So big shout out to him. I'll be putting his Instagram handle below. So before we get into it, please be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Again, I'm just starting this off, so do me a big favor. If you're into sneakers, I'm gonna try to be doing this on the regular. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. So let's get right into it. So here it is. The Easy Boots 700 and the Analog Colorway. Woo! This shoe, looking at it, looks fire. Like, I'm not even lying. This shoe is fire. I think to me, even though it doesn't really have a lot of color to it and it's more on the neutral tones, it's a pretty good shoe that I can say you can probably rock with a lot of things and that's pretty much what I like about it. Um, I'd say that the color, the creams, and the whites on this shoe, are, it's pretty interesting. The outsole, the outsole is black. It's the same that we've seen on the Yeezy 700 soft and static colorways. When we get to the midsole, now the midsole isn't something that we've seen yet in any other 700s that have released. It is an off-white cream color. And really this is the part of the shoe that actually sold it to me when I first saw the mock-ups in 2018. That's what made me really want this shoe. So again, it's an off-white cream color. Then we get to the two ovals on the midsole on the both sides, they're white. And then the two other enclaves that are in the front of the midsole are white as well. Then when we get to the top of the shoe, uh, the suede panels on the front, the back, and on the sides of the top of the shoe are actually a grayish color. Then we get to the leather that's where the loopholes are at and that is the off-white cream color that's similar to the midsole. Uh, the other hints on the shoe that have that cream color are going to be the two suede panels on the sides of the shoe where the three end is at. They are kind of a cream suede and then the mesh that's on uh, the top of the shoe are also, it's also an off-white cream color. Um, looking at it, I want to say that the mesh that is on the front and the sides of the shoe are also an off-white cream color. Um, it's not as noticeable compared to the leather and compared to the midsole and even the mesh that's on the back of the shoe. And pretty much just with every other Yeezy Boost 700, you have your hits of 3M that are on it the middle of the shoe on both sides, then on the back of the shoe you have 3M hits and the little holes that are there. So yeah, I mean I'm really digging this shoe. This shoe is fire in hand and I honestly can't wait to you know start wearing this shoe. I mean it's awesome. I'm pretty I'm so happy that I have this in hand. I mean the shoe hasn't even been announced yet, officially announced. The date hasn't even been announced. It's rumored that it's April 13th and I'm usually I'm pretty sure it's gonna be around that time. I am excited to start wearing this shoe. So leave your thoughts. What do you guys think of the Yeezy Boost 700? Are you liking it? Are you not? Uh, leave a comment on this video and I'll see you in the next video.